It was a wild weather event as torrential rains pounded the State College area late Thursday afternoon. Spring Creek flooded Puddentown Road in Howserville as well as the nearby park. The water here was reported to be three feet high at one point. AccuWeather says three to five inches of rain fell in the center region, triggering the widespread flooding. Parts of North Atherton Street and East College Avenue were closed when water swamped drain pipes. A culvert in front of the Blaze Alexander car dealership filled up with rushing water and overflowed. The powerful current chiseled through a 10-foot chunk of asphalt and pushed it about 20 feet down the road. A tornado reportedly was sighted near Bullsburg, but that has not been confirmed. It's hard to even guess how many basements were flooded, but this storm clearly affected a lot of people, especially people living along creeks and streams. Well, there are a lot of flooded basements in the area like, uh, like this one. It's a mess. This basement is at my house. At the Marvin Gardens apartment complex on South Pew Street, residents in basement apartments were forced out of their homes when water began pouring through windows and doors. Came in all at once, like so, maybe the back door had come open or something. Well, there appears to be a lot of water damage. The water was up over the basement windows, so the basement apartments are flooded in both the buildings. Several units from the Alpha Fire Company responded, but they had to wait until power was cut before they could go inside. I noticed that my window wall was full of water as well. I just thought it was coming in extremely rapidly. Water levels were rising, so I decided it was dangerous to be in there. I ran out with my dog. Jesse showed me the view through the door. Several inches of dirty water and debris were clearly visible. Steve Bauer, reporting for StateCollege.com, your online source for news.